Hello everyone, this is Bear from Northern Extreme Snowmobiling. I'm here to go over some rules, regulations, and safety tips to make your riding with us more enjoyable. First off, traffic flow. In the state of New Hampshire, every single trail has two-way traffic. So we ask you to operate on the right side of the trail at all times. It is very important that all the snowmobiles remain single file while traveling down the trail. We do not pass and we do not follow too closely. You must keep a safe distance between your snowmobile and the snowmobile in front of you. The maximum speed allowed in the state of New Hampshire is 45 miles per hour. This does not mean you must travel at 45 miles per hour. This means that is the maximum speed you are allowed to go. We ask you to please ride at a speed that you are comfortable riding at that helps you maintain control of your snowmobile. Safety is the most important factor of your ride with us here in the White Mountains. Now we're gonna switch over to the operation of the machine. Okay, everyone. Now we're gonna run down the controls of our snowmobile. Starting with the most important piece of equipment. On our left-hand handlebar, you'll find this lever located here. This is the brake. Simply apply pressure to the brake and you will immediately feel the machine slowing down and coming to a stop. Going over to the right-hand handlebar, we have this red button. This is the emergency engine stop switch. When it's in the upright position, your engine will run. To start our engine, we go to our left-hand side. We have an orange button. Simply push in the button, hold it for a few seconds, and our machine is running. Going back over to our emergency engine stop switch, simply push it down, and it shuts the whole machine down. Okay. Now our throttle is located on the right-hand handlebar and is operated with your thumb. You're simply going to apply slow, steady, even pressure to the throttle, and this is how we get our machine to move. Okay. Going back over to the left-hand controls, we have heaters in our grips and in our throttle. These are controlled by the switches here right above our start button. I'm going to start the machine and I'm going to show you how these work. On our dashboard, in between our speedometer and our tachometer, we have a gauge that shows us our gas. Right now, this has a full tank, as you can see by all of these black bars. When I want to adjust my heat, first in my grips, I use this button. If you look at your gas gauge, when I adjust up or down, you'll see the gas gauge switches over to an indicator for my heat. Up and down. Now that's for the grips. For the throttle, it's the button right next to it. Same thing. Adjust it up, adjust it down. Okay folks, now that I'm on the machine, we're going to show you first how to turn. As you're traveling down the trail, and you want to make a left-hand turn, you very simply turn your handlebars to the left for a left-hand turn. We do put a little bit of a lean into our turns, so that's a left-hand turn. Going to the right, we simply turn the handlebars to the right, and just a little bit of a lean to the right. Now, I'm going to start up our machine and I'm going to show you how we make her move. Once again, the throttle on the right-hand handlebar. Simply apply even pressure very slowly at first until you feel it engage and you're on your way. Our reverse lever is located right next to your right knee. You must be at a full stop. I pull the lever back as you can hear my backup alarm sounding. Once again, very easy pressure on the throttle and back we go. Come to a full stop once again, push the lever back in and we're back in drive. Okay everyone, that's basic safety and operation on a snowmobile. We look forward to seeing you here at Northern Extreme Snowmobiling and getting you out on the beautiful trails in the White Mountains of New Hampshire. See you out there.